1942, <coughs> uh, the end, the uh, west end of Tennessee was taken over. People told them to move, and the government built a city there called Oak Ridge. And its purpose was to make uranium-235, <coughs> uh, which is what blows up in an atom bomb. So they set it up uh, with super security and then security on a security, you know, uh, the, the full Valhalla of security. Uh, uh, these three people. Uh, walked up to it, up a hill to get to it, sniffed their way through th several rows of fence, entered the place, and painted peace uh, uh, slogans on the wall of the great cement building where they actually make the uranium-235. Super security. <laughs> Failed 100%. And the uh, tons of recrimination that followed. Oh, well, what to have the usual thing is uh, the, the social cliques are looking inward so intently they don't dare look away from each other or they get stabbed in the back <laughs> uh, that they can't see uh, an 82 year old nun. A drifter and a house painter with religion on their minds coming through several layers of fence and painting peace slogans on the cement wall of the building that they make U-235 in. Well, this is the Washington Post. I'm not 100% clear this is not fiction. I don't know. There's a great little story, though. That's about all I can say at the moment.